Hey, lovely people, Couponing Crystal here. Welcome back to the channel, Coupon Crew. In today's video, we've got a Walmart I bought a haul. We've got a shout out. We've got a little bit of shop kick added in, and we're gonna do the structure of the video a little different today. I'm not gonna do a in total breakdown, guys, because I did a little I bought a shopping over the weekend, Friday. So it's a combination of some highlighted I bought a rebates that I wanted to share with you guys and some good deals and a swag buck deal as a whale all right so now before we jump into the actual haul we need to do one shout out let's shout out slat slat decided to use my referral code with ibotta and i got an additional five dollars so thank you so very much for using my ibotta code i appreciate you so very much you're taking your coupon into a whole nother level <laughs> All right, guys, so let's jump into this haul. Now, the funny thing about this first rebate, guys, it is a swag buck deal, okay? This is the Alba Botanica, and this is actually the shampoo and conditioner. It's coconut milk and shampoo and conditioner, all right? They're priced $3 each in my Walmart. Didn't have a coupon, and you better not use a coupon with this deal, okay? Because it says that in the description of it, all right? So you're going to pay $6 for the two. You're going to submit your receipt to Swagbucks, and Swagbucks is going to give you back $10, making these be free and a four dollar money maker now i was fussing about swag bucks to my friend youtuber savvy saver diva jackson because it seems like every time i do swag bucks is some extra with it okay you gotta make sure that you add the offer before you purchase it please 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 make sure you do that now initially when i uploaded my receipt it did not pick this item up all right so i submitted a um email to swag bucks and swag bucks actually fixed it today i did this deal today so you know keep that in mind if you decide to do this deal but i do believe it's a great deal okay so i was actually after today if they didn't get my stuff straight i was gonna not do swag bucks anymore and delete the app i'm gonna just be honest <laughs> I'll talk more about that at the end of the video. Okay, let's move on with the deals. The next rebate I decided to do was a, a Bada Walmart deal. This is the Bulldog and this is the original face wash, guys. It's priced $6.97 in my Walmart. They had this crap. <laughs> they had this stuff locked in a case okay really it's face wash guys 6.97 didn't have a coupon so i paid 6.97 in store there is a seven dollar i bought a rebate making the final cost free and a three cent money maker great deal the next thing i did and i hope you guys are taking advantage of this is the yo plate yogurt and i did it friday where it was three i believe 3.98 back and it was absolutely free it reset and this time it's three dollars and 84 cents so the actual price in store is $3.98. Didn't have a coupon. I paid $3.98 and got back $3.84, making the final cost $0.14 cents for the Yo Plate. Now there is a coupons.com coupon, but it's this combined with the Go Gurt. So that's up to you if you want to do that and purchase that. You know, it's up to you. <laughs> Next rebate, guys, was on the Hawaiian Mini sub rolls the hawaiian sweet mini sub rolls as you can see we got some missing over here people just be doing the most named richard okay first of all these are not rolls why is there a top missing let's get back to the video they're priced $3.78 in my Walmart. Didn't have a coupon, so I paid $3.78 in store. There is a $1. I bought a rebate, making the final cost $2.78. So I made a sandwich last night. I grilled him or cooked him a piece of salmon and made him a sandwich. And some odd reason, somebody decides to eat the top off of one of the subs, which it's... Next rebate 
is the Smart Water, guys. Smart Water, all right? It's priced $1.58 and my Walmart didn't have a coupon, so I had to pay $1.58 in store. There is a 79 cent I bought a rebate, making the final cost 79 cents for the Smart Water. This is a flavored water. This one is tangerine extract tranquility so i'm gonna be curious to see what this is going to taste like all right next rebate i did was on the pf chang's signature vinaigrette dressing all right so this one was priced three dollars and 28 cents i did not have a coupon so i had to pay 328 in store but there is a dollar and 75 cents i bought a rebate making the final cost a dollar 53 for the pf chang's signature vinaigrette dressing guys now next rebate i decided to do was a little pricey razor the skin to mint bloom priced seven dollars and 97 cents in my walmart i did have a four dollar coupon from the 516 smart source so that dropped my cost in store to 3.97 there is a three dollar i bought a rebate making the final cost 97 cents for the skin to mint bloom okay next deal i decided to do was a shop kick deal that's right all right, so the first product that I purchased was the Heinz <laughs> a special video tonight, guys. Heinz yellow mustard. This is the eight ounce, okay? Now, it was priced 98 cents in my Walmart. Now, I'm gonna scan in store, but what you're gonna do, you're gonna scan a larger bottle in store so you can get your in-store kicks, okay? Now, for the next product, you could get a smaller one, but I wanted to actually try the Cranch. So this one is actually a 19 ounce, all right? So it was priced in my Walmart, $2.98. Didn't have a coupon, had to pay $2.98. So I scanned it in store and my kicks back combined with my bonus kicks because there's bonus kicks that it's giving you for purchasing the two products together, which is 300 additional kicks. It comes out to be a dollar 46 coming back for each one, making the mustard be free and a 48 cent money maker. And then the crunch, a dollar and 52 cents. That's a pretty good size bottle. So I think that is a great deal because I wanted to try it. Yeah. All right, let's move on, guys. We're going to move on to Publix. Yes, I got a little Publix sprinkled in here because I went to Publix and Publix has some good deals because Crystal's trying to get her rebates so she can get her bonuses, okay? <laughs> this is the Rody Energy Drink. Yes, I got so many energy drinks. I got to find somebody to give them to. This was actually only a dollar and 25 cents in my Publix. Didn't have a coupon, so I paid a dollar 25. The great thing, there is actually a $2 and 99 cent. I bought a rebate, making the final cost be free and a dollar 74 cents money maker. Good deal. Next rebate, guys, this was a great deal as well. The Carbona carpet cleaners okay this one is the carbona carpet cleaner this one was priced and they're bogo this week guys priced five dollars and 39 cents so in my Publix, when you do bogo items you don't have to purchase both you can get just one and it's going to be half price this one ended up being two dollars and 70 cents is what i had to pay in store there is a two dollar i bought a rebate making the final cost only 70 cents for the carbona carpet cleaner yes next one for the carbona there's another rebate which is the pet one this is the pet stain and odor for the carbona it's a little more it's 559 bogo the cost in store was 279 i didn't have a coupon some people have said in their videos that they had hang tags in their Publix. i did not okay <laughs> There is a $2 I bought a rebate, making the final cost only 79 cents for the Carbona Pet Stain Carpet Cleaner. Great deal. Yeah. The last rebate I did, guys, was on the Burt's Bees Toothpaste for Kids. This was priced $3.29. Didn't have a coupon, so I paid $3.29. Now, there is a $2 I bought a rebate, making the final cost $1.29 for the Burt's Bees 
kids to face. I got plenty of grandbabies I can give that to. <laughs> now, like I said, to save on time, I'm not gonna do a breakdown, guys, because you can already know I pay with our bottom money. Nine times out of 10, I use some gift cards in combination with that. Yes, I did. But the great thing about today for my Publix items was in my Publix app, I actually had a two off a of 10 coupon. So if you guys decide to go to Publix, make sure you check your app to see if you have a two off of $10 purchase coupon. That will be great. You'll type in your phone number and it will automatically come off of your transaction and that it makes for a great, a great deal, guys. I hope these a few little rebates were helpful for you. I think there are some great ones. Now, I did want to go back and discuss about the Alba Botanica, okay? Like I said, it did not pick up for some reason. I'm going to show you what it did, what it showed on the app. And I actually in uninstalled the app reloaded it again and it still did it that's the reason why i contacted uh swag bucks on messenger and i also ended up doing a ticket because i didn't understand why it was doing that because i didn't actually submit the ticket so they ended up giving me credit for it so i did get my ten dollars so you know what that's all that matter crystal just wanted her credit but in my personal opinion I am selective about what deals I do with swag bucks because it appears to me, <laughs> this just me, that it's extra. Every time I do swag bucks, I don't know what the problem is. I did the method. Okay, I did the method last week. I didn't even post the video because it seems like every time I upload something to them, it's something extra, okay? That's just me. Let me know in the comments below if that is your experience, but that is my experience with Swagbucks. My favorite, favorite, all time, first app is Ibotta, okay? Ibotta to me is user friendly, it's newbie friendly, it's easy to navigate, I like it. To me, uh, Swag Bucks, not so much, guys. That's just me. It's just so much on the app. It's just cluttered, but that's just me. They need to send me a survey and ask me what I think about it, and I will tell them the truth. Roof, okay? <laughs> but, you know, uh, it is what it is. I, I'm kind of selective. I don't feel comfortable doing a whole lot of rebates for them and have so much money coming back. You know, I don't know. I'll just have to see how they go. I'm gonna spend that good $10 though. And another thing I don't like, I don't like submitting for my gift card and waiting for my gift card to come. I don't like that either. I I, I don't like that, okay? With Ibotta, I get my money back easy, okay? With Shopkick, I might have to wait for it for a receipt to you know process, but I can immediately use my points for gift cards. And I like that, okay? so. Everybody has their opinion. That's mine, okay? <laughs> That's it, guys. I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your evening. And remember, click to save and you will be amazed. Bye-bye.